A beautiful Saturday on the prairie sets the stage for Queen City X and a much anticipated battle between the Elks and the Riders next door at Mosaic Stadium. Again this year, BD will get us underway at Mosaic. Thank you very much for joining us here in Regina. Mario Alford, a little bobble to get started. Takes it at the 10, and now he's got some room. Here he goes. Look out, Mario Alford. The race is on to the 30, and this guy is out of here. Bye-bye, Super Mario. Into this game, his longest was a 30-yarder all season. We know what he's capable of. He just outruns the angles and is gone after bobbling the opening kickoff. He takes it to the house, and I think this crowd is in it. <laughs> what a way to get your crowd going. We're going to look at Trey Ford, who takes the field 35 seconds into this game, trailing by seven, trying to get behind their defense. Ford, pressure in his face, escapes out to the right on the run. He's going to keep it. He's got a first down. And he eventually steps out of bounds inside the 25, and that is where he can absolutely kill you. Throwing from the pocket has improved tenfold throughout the practice. Well, practices over the last month. Beatty knocks it up and puts it home. He'll need two more here. Hickson stands in to the right of his quarterback. Patterson's going to keep it, and he's got to manage Sean Bain. Bain will take it down inside the 45. Brett Lother to restore the seven-point lead, and that one is wide right of 24. They have not had a victory since. Ford down the field looking for Gino Lewis, and he's got him. Lewis pulls it in just inside the 40. 72.2% coming in to week nine. Dave Julian gets that ball down. Beatty knocks it up. And he knocks it through. He never did that before. McLeod Bethel Thompson showed him the way. Second and four. Ford way down the field. Drops it in there on the far side. And now it's off to the races the other way. Tevin Jones, the former rider, with a major strike. His first as a member of the Elks. This is how you visualize the play unfolding. You drop back, you have good protection. You step up, you see your starting wide receiver out there in behind coverage and you drop it right in his hand you can't throw that football any better tevin jones takes it to the house earlier was released and then brought back with the injury to kevin brown second and six here forward with pressure in his face gets it away and what a catch gittens jr from the rider 49 Leak this time. Javon Leak around Milligan and down the sideline. He'll take it. Now it's been a bit an adventure. This is a chip shot field goal for Morris Beatty, but it's been a bit of an adventure for him over the last couple of weeks. A little bit of a roller coaster up and down. Uh oh. Well, if they're offside, the riders are offside. It's a new set. Javon Leak in the game at running back in behind Trey Ford. They'll give it to him. Leak right up the middle, untouched, and he's in. Touchdown, Edmonton. Javon Leak, his first as a member of the Elks. He's 6 of 10 for 67 so far. Just three men this time coming his way. Steps up, has a lot of room over the middle, and Ajoa Joe leans back to haul that one in. First down, Riders. Patterson. Down the field for Bain, hauls it in. Touchdown, Riders, Patterson. Bain, end zone. After review, the ruling on the field is overturned. The ball will be placed at the one-yard line. First down, Saskatchewan. Patterson steps up, first and goal from the one. Looking to punch it in himself, and he does. Touchdown, Riders. That one's going to count. Patterson, fourth rushing touchdown of the season for the quarterback. They really couldn't get anything going offensively. Settled in, finished with that touchdown, and now they're back at it again. Hickson, he's had a couple of those runs in this game, hasn't he? In the pocket, now down the field, up for grabs, far side, and 
incomplete. Creeping up towards midfield. Ford, a ton of time. Way down the field, looking for Gino Lewis. Intercepted. Roland Milligan, who else? Looking for Lewis. Heavily covered. And Milligan is there to take it away for the Riders. 13th interception of the year for the Riders defense. That's tops in the league. Patterson on the run. Asks for Keyshawn Johnson to come back to him. He does, and the Riders have a first down. Patterson eyes down the field. Now he's got some pressure in his face. Trying to escape. Block opens things up, and now Patterson's got some room on the far side. He's forced out of bounds and will not have enough to pick up the first down. Three-man pressure. Ford still feels it. Got it away to Gino Lewis trying to spin ahead. Great tackling there. He stopped at the 52-yard shy of an Edmonton first down. Julian. Skies went in. Alford takes it cleanly just inside the 10. And he's got a little bit of speed on the far side of the field. Super Mario hopping his way up to the 50. And eventually forced out of bounds at midfield. Coming up on a quarter I, I, break. I could do 30. You got three minutes to the end of the quarter. <laughs> Let me load up a play for you. Ugh. See what you can pull off. See what you can do. Here's Patterson down the field. Keith Sean Jackson's got it. Well thrown ball from Patterson too. Three options to his right. That's where he's going to throw. He's looking to the end zone. Ajoa and Joe goes up and he's got it. Unreal stuff from Ajoa and Joe. And the Riders go on top. Touchdown Saskatchewan. Get back and get ready for the next play. This was the touchdown to a Jojo. It's Bynum that he beats, going up, up over the top in the contested catch, comes down with it for the major. And then you got to flush that one as a DB. Don't let it go. Get on to the next play. Even though you're in good position, receiver makes an outstanding catch. In the shotgun, turns, takes the handoff, dumps it over the top. Broken up! Bynum working against Sibylis! Patterson, backpedaling, a little bit of pressure. Now he's gonna escape out to his right. Fires one over there. And Bynum steps in. A Joe, a Joe. Watching on. Is that gonna be a taunting play? It might be, yeah. Elks will send four. Patterson stays in the pocket. Now he's in trouble and he's taken down. Spent more time working at Savon than I did in any post-secondary institute, so... I want to get one of those hoodies. Dustin Nielsen, Savon Foods. Here's Javon Lee. Look at this! Wide open, down to the 20, to the 10! Touchdown, Edmonton! Javon lee has got his second of the game. This one, a big one. And the Elks go back on top with 11 minutes to play to make it a seven-point game. Ford, wide open, back of the end zone. They got it, Curly Giddens. Second and one. Patterson takes it on the far side, and look at him go. Shea Patterson to the 50, all the way up to midfield, staying out of the grasp of Niles Morgan. Second and 10 for Patterson. Four-man rush. Patterson down the field, over the middle, wide open. Just inside the 20, the catch is made. Three options out to the left for Patterson. Edmonton's going to bring the house. Patterson in trouble on the run and taken down. Purifoy and the blitz pays off. Patterson, a little bit more time here. He's going to look for an end zone shot. Lays it out there. A Joe and Joe. No. Out of bounds is what they'll say. Was his left foot down when that when ball, the ball hit the hands? Yeah. Before it bounced back up. This be a close look. After review, the ruling on the field stands. South Saskatchewan will be charged a timeout. They work from the 49. They'll hand it off. Lee, go look at this. He's done it again. Down to the 30, to the 20. Are you kidding me? Javon Leak with a house call to possibly seal it away. His third rushing touchdown of the football game. Wow. 61 yards. 
Got to move quick here. Patterson. Over three. Down the field. Over the middle. Intercepted. Cordell Jackson takes it away for Edmonton. And now he's going to return it back inside. The 35 has his helmet yanked off at the end of the play. He has made the difference. Or over the middle to Tevin Jones. And Jones is going to walk it in. That's his second touchdown of the game against his former club. And the Boo Birds are out at Mosaic. It's a long time to go staring at the ceiling at night, figure, trying to figure out how you're going to get back in the wind call. Patterson end zone one last time. And that one's still laying there. Good luck making a call on this. Touchdown. And call it a touchdown. Touchdown late. Trey Ford gets the start and immediately delivers a victory for the Elks.